Hi everyone, I am Dikshita and I am delighted to announce that Marathi Tech Labs has been featured on Clutch in the top 10 companies across three different categories Artificial Intelligence, Machine Learning and Natural Language Processing We have featured in their leaders matrix among 7,008 global companies across these three categories and today we are joined by Pinaki Narivana. Pinakin leads the artificial intelligence and machine learning projects here at Marathi Tech Labs. His years of experience working on AIML and the right eye for detail are some of the major reasons we have achieved this ranking today. Welcome Pinakin. Hi Dixita, thanks for having me. Artificial intelligence is a vast subject. What specific domains have we worked on when it comes to AIML and NLP projects? We have worked in a range of industries when it comes to AI projects. Some of them are automotive, insurance, legal tech. We have also extensively worked in the healthcare space and we hope to expand our work to other industries as well. Can you cover some of your AIML projects in more detail? Sure. We have extensively worked on predictive modeling and ana analytics. One of our client operates a call center and their key clients happen to be political parties. This client has a team of more than 500 telemarketers who call up on potential donors that might be interested in funding certain political parties' campaigns. You would agree that making sales pitches on the phone to, a to an answering machine is a waste of time for the telemarketers. To address this, we built a predictive model that could identify whether the agent was speaking to a human or a non-human. That includes answering machine, fax machine, dead audio, etc. The goal was to identify whether a human or non-human on the other end of the phone in less than 500 milliseconds. If the call connects to a non-human, it should disconnect immediately and move on to the next number. Implementing this saved the call center a significant amount of time. That's an interesting use case. I'm sure this challenge is quite common across all call centers. Yeah, it is. Another project involved us building a machine learning model for a car, car parts manufacturer. The model helped them predict the sales cycle for different parts so that they could predict the upcoming demands and avoid overstocking and under, understocking inventory. In one of the projects, we predicted the price of used car based on the different market factors. We have also worked with the computer vision to detect barcode numbers from the receipts, vary information from documents to speed up the underwriting process and building a computer vision model to detect image thefts. There is a multitude of interesting use cases. That sounds amazing. Speaking of AI projects, what kind of challenges have you encountered while implementing AI solutions? We have faced different challenges during different phases of the projects, but I would like to point out the challenges we usually face during the initial phase of the project. Because you know, people have different ideas about what AI is and what its implementation looks like. One challenge is lack of data. It becomes difficult to train the model without sufficient historical data. Another challenge is achieving the required accuracy with the available data. The model's accuracy depends on the real-time data that we work with during production. Also, it is important to communicate the cost of the required infrastructure for building and running the model. And that's the reason we conduct an AI readiness audit before getting to the actual development of the solution. This involves really validating the idea by analyzing the data sets and identifying the best approach to model development. This is done so that an implementation roadmap is in place before we get into the actual development. That is really valuable in terms of saving both time and cost for your clients. Clutch recognizing us in their leadership matrix across three different service lines, that is AI, ML and NLP, is of course no small feat. How would you say we achieved this ranking? The most important factor is my incredible team. The team goes to a great length to ensure that the client goals are achieved. One of the factor would be definitely the wonderful clients we work with. We are grateful for their cooperation and feedback, which has helped us provide better services. Another factor would also be the timing being right. In the overall market, 
there is a better understanding of how much AI can achieve and what some of its constraints are. And lastly, what lies ahead for your team in terms of the type of AI projects that you take up? At this point, the team is working on projects from the healthcare, legal tech and automotive industries. Our goal is to maintain a strong foothold in these industries and further expand our domain knowledge to help existing and new customers better. We are also in very early stages of ideating new products that solve specific pain points for customers in retail and automotive space. The idea is that these products can be part of Maruti Tech service offering just as our product whatnot in the chatbot space. Thanks Finagin for chatting with us. Thank you Bixita for having me.